So let's talk about the benefits of bee pollen. It's quite interesting. Bee pollen is the primary source of food for bees, um, especially the protein. But there's a lot of things in bee pollen that actually is good for us as well. It does have some carbs. It has honey. It has vitamins. It has amino acids. It has essential fatty acids. It has minerals and trace minerals. It has over 29 friendly bacteria that were identified. And it has over 188 fungi, which are friendly to our systems. There's also fermented byproducts in bee pollen, uh, which give it lactic acid to fight off pathogens. There's over 250 different substances in bee pollen from many different species of plants. You also have flower pollen, nectar, enzymes, honey, which I mentioned, and wax. So let's talk about what bee pollen is good for. Allergies, okay? Number two, sinus congestion, especially if it's a chronic sinus congestion. So even though if you have a fungus growing in your sinus, it's not related to allergies, this can help you. It has antifungal properties. It can be used as a natural antibiotic. It's very antimicrobial, antiviral. It has anti-inflammatory properties. It's hepatoprotective, which means it helps protect your liver. It can help stimulate the immune system. It can help to naturally detoxify your liver. It's also been used in wound healing and burns. And it even has properties that can help reduce placking in your arteries. It's quite amazing. Hey, before you go real quick, I have a course entitled How to Bulletproof Your Immune System. It's a free course. I want you to take it. And here's why. Here's you. Here is your environment. Everyone is focused on this over here, avoiding your environment. But what about here? What about strengthening your immune system? That's what's missing. This course will show you how to bulletproof yourself. And so you can tolerate and resist your environment much better by strengthening your own immune system. I put a link down in the description right down below. Check it out and get signed up today.